I'm Will Truman. I've got a baby, a baby boomer background, you know, born in 1960. And I've got very early recollections of native fish. My father, Harry Truman, was a keen fisherman. He used to go fishing for both trout and Murray cod. And an indelible memory I've got as a four-year-old is of a giant Murray cod uh, hanging off a tree that my dad caught in the Goulburn River near Seymour. When I was eight years old, my dad was killed at work. And you know, that was a great loss for me personally, but it certainly changed the direction of my life because without a father as a young, as a, as a boy, I wanted to go out and do the things that my dad used to do. I wanted to emulate my father. I wanted to catch the fish that my dad used to catch. So, you know, as a boy, a teenager, I used to read the angling books, the Lance Wedlick books that would say if you went to the King Parrot Creek you could catch Murray Cod, or if you went to the Broken River you could catch Macquarie Perch. And I used to look up the train timetables and catch trains to these places and take my push bike with me and ride out uh, to these streams and talk to the locals. And in every case the locals said, uh, we haven't caught those fish here for 20 years. And I used to go to stream after stream and hear the same story. A close friend of my father, uh, Tom Kelly, he wasn't a fisherman, but he took me under his wing. He was in the quarrying game and he used to travel all over Victoria looking for building sites and quarrying ventures. And he took me up to the Strathbogie Ranges and there was a creek called the Seven Creeks. And in that creek, uh, was a population of trout, cod and macquarie perch, the fish that were in my family stories, and I was able to go out and catch them, and that profoundly changed the direction of my life. So I was bitten with the bug on native fish, and having caught those fish and experienced just how wonderful they were to catch, they, they were fantastic, I was catching them on flies and lures, um, I thought, why haven't we got this everywhere? And about that time, there was a dis uh, the argument was taking place in the scientific community as to whether there really was a separate species of cod, the trout cod, whether they were just one species that were variable or, or there was two. And the argument had gone on for 150 years and two scientists uh, investigated it, uh, Alan Weatherly from Australian National University and Tim Bearer from Ohio State University, they came out and they caught trout cod from the Seven Creeks, placed them side by side with Murray cod and realised they were different species and so the, the, the debate was resolved that there was a separate species. You know, I'd hoped that Dad would have seen the documenting of the history as a valuable thing but ultimately History is interesting, it should be the driver of change that we do something about bringing things back and making things right, correcting the mistakes we've done in the past. So I would hope that that would be something that my, my father would, would have uh, very much enjoyed uh, this aspect of this project. <laughs>